Hello, my amazing, beautiful, wonderful, fantastic friends. Welcome back to my channel. It has been a while, I know, but let me just quickly say I want to thank every single one of you for being so kind and for being in my life because I don't know what would have happened if I didn't have you guys or the other people in my life, of course, but I never in a million years would have thought that so many people would be so concerned about my well-being and would want me to be happy. I never, it's like unimaginable to me. It's still wild to think about. Reading all the comments on my previous video, it was just kind of surreal. So I just want to thank every single one of you. But I'm here and it's been like a month <laughs> since I've last uploaded a video. So it feels a little awkward talking in front of the camera again, but I'm going to try to do videos again. I really want to because I love YouTube and this platform saved my life um, more times than I can count. So I do want to come back and try to get back on a schedule. I remember asking you guys on my Instagram a while ago and I asked you guys what you wanted to see on my channel. The most requested thing was a what I eat in a day or a what I eat in a week quarantine edition. So to ease back into it, I'm just gonna do a what I eat in a day. But if you wanna see a what I eat in a week video quarantine edition, then comment that below and I will definitely do that. Quick disclaimer, I guess. It hasn't been that good. Like my eating schedule has been so off along with like my sleeping schedule and things like that. And I'm sure you guys understand and some of you guys can probably even relate but I used to be someone that would have their first meal of the day anywhere between I don't know sometimes I would have it even at like 9 in the morning but most of the times it was like around 10 but now I feel like I've been having my first meal at like 2 p.m. <laughs> because I've been staying up late later for me y'all know it's later for me because I'm a grandma I used to go to bed at like 9 or 10 p.m. but now because Animal Crossing is a thing love Animal Crossing by the way if you have Animal Crossing if you have a switch Comment below your switch code and we can be like friends, yes. <laughs> but yeah, Animal Crossing has taken over my life. I don't know, I'm really, I don't really have much of a set routine like I used to. That's just a disclaimer, I guess. I'm not trying to say that this is healthy. I'm not trying to recommend anyone eats this way or anything like that. This is just a realistic what I eat in a day because I want to be real with you guys. I don't want to try really hard just for this video. I want to show you guys just what I've been eating on a somewhat daily basis. And I'm just warning y'all that it's not the best. It's gonna be maybe a little different. We are trying our best here. I hope all of you and your loved ones are staying safe as well. So comment below something that has been getting you through quarantine. Mine is Animal Crossing and Stephanie Sue. And re-watching The Vampire Diaries for like the 10th time, but whatever. It is almost 1 p.m. right now and I'm still not really all that hungry, but I'm gonna make some tea because I love tea, so let's make that. <laughs> I'm so awkward now. I mean like I was always awkward, but now I've taken 20 steps back, so hopefully y'all stay with me through this journey. Unnecessarily long intro, what else is new? Okay, so let's make some tea. So the tea that I've been having a lot lately has been this moon tea. I got it from Michelle Fawn, who is the queen of makeup, beauty, YouTube, guru, whatever, that side of YouTube. If you grew up like at the same time as I did, I was born in 1997, then you should know Michelle Fawn. She was it. She still is it. And I'm so happy to see her back on YouTube. So she made something in one of her videos called Moon Tea. And she said that Earl Grey tea is the best. So that is what I've been using and it is divine. I still have my chocolate chai tea every now and then. I'm just feeling this right now. So I used to use the oatmeal cookie creamer one, which is the best, but it was sold out the last time I went to Sprouts. So I just got the vanilla one, which honestly tastes just as good. It's a marketing thing for me, you know? I see oatmeal cookie and I'm just like, ugh need that. And then for my Koya drink, I use coconut almond. This is delicious. And then I add maybe a quarter of a drop, not even, of this vanilla cream liquid stevia. So we're just gonna let this soak. I let this soak for about like two minutes. And while it's soaking, that's when I start to boil the water. I boil water in the microwave, which my friend thought was insane but I don't have like a kettle or anything, so. I got these vegan chocolate chip cookies from Sprouts. So bomb. They came in like a, this is a dark chocolate pretzel container that I finished, obviously. And they came in like a brown box, but it doesn't, I felt like they would get stale. So I just reused this. Flames. 
They're so soft and chewy. Mm -hmm. If you have a sprout and you find these, get them 100%. I also just ordered a bunch of Amiibo from Etsy because I really want to get Marshall on my island. I'm going to put him right here. Look at how cute he is. I. I need him. I need him on my island immediately. I needed him like yesterday. I finally started posting on TikTok again, which feels really nice. I also almost have like 60K on TikTok, which I thought was pretty neat. I mean, I know that's not like a big number, but any number with like a K on the end of it following me, I'm like, what the fuck? Like, are y'all lost? I think y'all are lost. Okay, so it's been four minutes and now I'm just gonna like squeeze the tea bag. I don't know if you're like supposed to do that or not. Ah, that is so good. <laughs> mm. So I'm gonna have my tea and then I will be back when I'm eating something else. Um, honestly, I've just been doing like a lot of snacking, which I know isn't good, I know. But I'm trying to be real, I'm trying to be real with y'all. I don't want to lie to y'all and act as if I'm perfect during all of this because I'm not. I'm just gonna drink my tea. I'm gonna play some Animal Crossing. I'll see y'all later. This is Bob, my king. Oh my god, legendary. Be gay, do crimes. Direct quote from Bob. Or I should show y'all like my character, I guess. So this is what my little character looks like. She's cute. <laughs> I also have uh, a Yona custom design outfit. I have like other outfits too. This is just like the goth aesthetic. This is the kind of style I wish I had. It's called a peacock butterfly. Now it's my turn to strut my stuff. <laughs> Don't talk to all the villagers I want to stay and ignore the ones I want to leave. Talking to Zucker. Zucker's a cutie. Just talk to Maple and Zucker and Bob who are like my favorites. Oh my god, guys, last night I did a Nook Miles ticket and I ended up on Tarantula Island. That was the scariest experience of my life. Also have, I don't know if you guys will be able to hear it, but if you listen to my tune when I like talk to them, who do I have to talk to? Maybe I have to leave and come back in because it's the theme to Funky Town that plays. I'll go talk to one of my villagers, actually. Annalisa, come talk to me. Okay, ready? Maybe I should put my nut away so I don't end up hitting her. Did you hear it? It's cute. That doesn't look appetizing. <sighs> okay, so for a snack, lunch, I don't know what this is. I'm having some PB&J because I want some PB&J, but I kind of want something on the side of my PB&J. Some regular potato chips would be great, but I don't have any because I'm stupid. Some pretzels, maybe hummus. That's a weird combo, isn't it? It's a weird combination, but I kind of want to feel it right now. So that's what I'm going to do. Y'all, I haven't had oatmeal in so long. Like, I don't even remember the last time I had oatmeal because I can't be bothered to make oatmeal. I don't know who I am anymore. I think the last time I had oatmeal was over a month ago. I've been having PB&Js, though, for like almost every day for the past week. Mm, so simple, but it's so good. Mm. I have to learn how to get comfortable in front of the camera again. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me. So before we get started on chapter 19, which is on film dynamics, quiz 3 is scheduled for Monday. So we need to define some terms. And so spontaneity, we're going to be talking about spontaneous and non-spontaneous. So I've included processes energy. This is the new one. So 
some dinner and I am feeling which is a dinner I've been having a lot lately ravioli I love this ravioli hold on this ravioli right here so I was planning on having this but now I'm kind of wondering if I should have some gnocchi because I had this last night and I have this cauliflower gnocchi 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 you can roast me if I'm pronouncing that wrong I'm so sorry but I have this like cauliflower gnocchi that's really really good that I'll also show you guys it looks like this it's just, you get in the frozen aisle, it's green giant. Cauliflower and spinach. This is so good. This stuff is bomb. I think I've shown this on my channel like once before and I made it how it instructed me to, which was like in a pan and it came out a little mushy, but then someone commented to put it in the air fryer. So that's what I've been doing ever since I get this, I put it in the air fryer and it is magnificent. I'm kind of thinking I'm gonna make this and I'm gonna have it with broccoli, mushroom, spinach, uh, zucchini, because I have zucchini in the fridge as well that I should eat, and vegan sausage. This is a vegan sausage that I always use. This is so good. I just love Beyond Meat products. They are thebomb.com. So I like the hot Italian flavor. So that's gonna be my dinner. And I'm also going to make a sauce, usual sauce that I show on this channel so many times. But it's been a while, so maybe I need to recap y'all, you know? So we've got the Cedars garlic hummus, because this is my favorite hummus of all time, as y'all know. And I like to mix that with this marinara sauce. And it is this or Organico Bello spicy marinara. Let's get it at like Whole Foods or Sprouts or something like that. I'm gonna cook all of that up. And oh, for the air fryer, I don't know if I have to like let y'all know if you wanna know how to make this. I just put this in the air fryer at 390 for 12-ish minutes. So they're on there, like 10 to 15 minutes. So I'm gonna put everything together and then I will be back when it's done. Oh, I just realized this hair has been sticking out this whole time. Fantastic, love that. It looks nice and crispy. Ooh. I feel like this is my only good meal, like solid meal of the day. We are working on it. I am just trying to survive. <laughs> and there you have it, my guys and gals and non-binary pals. This hair is still out here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Mmm, <laughs> the texture is perfect. I put it in the air fryer for about 14 minutes. So I'm gonna eat my dinner and if I have dessert, which I do sometimes, sometimes I don't, I don't know. We'll see how I feel after this. But if I have dessert, I will be back that okay so I'm a little bit hungry I just want something sweet but I'm not super hungry so for dessert I'm just going to snack on some of these dark chocolate turbinado sea salt almonds and I usually get these from Trader Joe's but I was informed in one of my last videos that they are no longer vegan so I got these at Whole Foods and these are vegan so thank the Lord for that so I'm just gonna be snacking on a few of these I'll probably have I don't know like half of what's left here I'm again like I said I'm not super hungry but I want a little something sweet some chocolate that is going to conclude this video I hope it turned out okay again I'm a little weird in front of the camera right now because it's been a hot minute since I have filmed but I really do miss talking to you guys I miss making videos I miss reading your guys's comments so if you enjoyed this video uh, please give it a thumbs up but if you absolutely hated it of course you can give it a thumbs down because that's okay too comment anything else you would like to see on my channel and subscribe for more content by yours truly if you haven't already heard it today you are amazing you're beautiful you're wonderful you are so so valid and I am so happy that you are alive I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video bye